Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Nashua's 2012 Memorial Day Parade. As we remember those who have served us and have gone on, let us also call to mind those who are serving us around the world to protect the freedoms and rights that we now enjoy. Now approaching the review stand, the vanguard unit of today's parade, led by the Nashua Police Department. The Nashua Police Department Honor Guard. <laughs> Followed by the Nashua Fire Rescue Honor Guard. The Nashua High School South Royal Purple Marching Band under the direction of Tony Coronas. Good morning, Tony. Good morning, sir. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. Good. Grand Marshal for today's parade, Omer Cody, and the President of the Day, Remy McKeating. The Gold Star Navy Mothers. We're back here with the mascot, your name, sir? Lanatsis. 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 Sparrow Lanatsis. Well, thank you for your service. And well, you'll be the master of ceremonies? You'll be leading off this parade? Not, I don't think so this year. Okay. Yeah. And you served in World War II, obviously. What was that again? You served in World War, World War Absolutely, WWE. four years. Yeah. And where did you serve? 
In the Pacific. In the Pacific, on yeah. any particular? Okinawa. Uh, Okinawa. Yeah. On, on any particular ship or? Uh, uh, well, the ships, uh, there was, I don't know the name of the ship, but there was a thousand of them getting ready to, for landing and everything else. Uh, however, uh, to give you a little history with all those ships being out there in the ocean, I said there's probably a thousand of them and they were being attacked by kamikaze planes just diving right into them. And that was the worst and the most fear that you could have is that, that plane wouldn't hit your ship. Was your ship hit? No. no. I want to thank you very much for your service. You're welcome. Sir, and your name is? Uh, John Latvis. John Latvis? John Latvis. Thank you. Thank you for your service as well. Thank you. Uh, you served in uh, World War II. World War II. Were you on the same ships or? No, no. We were. We were went to high school together. Oh, wow. So, uh, w were you in the uh, what branch of the service? Air Force. Were? You're the Air Force. So you're. Were you a pilot? Yes. And I, I take it. I take it you've seen some, uh, some hard times. Uh, no. Uh, everything was fine. Fine. Well, I want to thank you very much for your service and for being part of the ceremonies today. Thank you. We're glad uh, to be here. We can't honor your, our servicemen enough. Thank well. you. Yeah. Thank you. See you anywhere you like. Our local city and state elected officials led by Mayor Donnelly Lozo. And I'm here with uh, Mayor Lozo, and uh, welcome to the ceremonies. Are you going to be officiating any of the, the, the events today at all? or? Well, today we uh, are actually pinning uh, Judge Coughlin, or I should call him Lieutenant Major or, uh, Coughlin, for a combat action um, award. And then uh, we'll start the parade, and uh, there's not too many things to officiate. Okay. Uh, but, you know, the parade committee has done a good job pulling everybody together. It's always a a great day and it's an event of course to remember um, not just our veterans but really Memorial Day is about our fallen soldiers right. and um, a little more somber uh, but trying to celebrate at the same time so we definitely do want to honor them correct? we do yes. it's important yes. it's important today's a day to remember I think most importantly I mean it's the 150th anniversary of uh, World War one it's um, the 50th anniversary of the Vietnam War um, so it's really an important day and we're constantly reminded even though we're still uh, engaged in afghanistan and the others that, that we have fallen soldiers there so we do yeah we do well thank you very much you're and welcome we'll, we'll see you around enjoy the parade all right thank you all right the penachuck middle school marching band our first division W Post 483 on a guard. Post 483 Commander Frank Souza, Auxiliary President Betty Belanger, Men's Auxiliary President Rodney Cataret. Members of Post 483, the Ladies and Men's Auxiliary. Girl Scout Troop 10147.
Our second division, the American Legion Post 3 of Nashua, the band led by Charlie Coletta. Legion Honor Guard, Commander Barney Barbera, Ladies Auxiliary President Priscilla Barbera, Sons of the American Legion, Commander Kenny York, and members of American Legion Post Number Three, Auxiliary Members and Sons of the Legion. And we're here with the uh, New Hampshire Color Guard or the National Color Guard. Yep. All right. And can I just ask who this parade person is here? Can you say your name? Catherine Oro. Catherine Oro. Can you smile? Can you smile and say cheese? Oh, well, that is a cute, <laughs> adorable outfit. Say thank well, you. Well, she's <laughs> obviously tried. she's going to be an eye catcher. And you, you folks are uh, part of the honor, the, the color guard. Oh, God, yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about what the color guard does? Uh, we go. Uh, President Auxiliary, why don't you take that? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm the President of the Auxiliary. Okay. And at the Color Guard, we march in parades, displaying our flags. Uh, sometimes we are asked to open at a baseball game. Just, just a little flag ceremony, and that's what we do. We do flag ceremonies. Flag ceremonies, and we thank you that you are going to be honoring our, our, our troops today. Yeah. Thank you very much. Middle School Marching Band. City Chapter, Disabled American Veterans of Nashua. Colors carried by the Civil Air Patrol Cadets of Nashua. DAV Chapter 7 members, Military Order of the Purple Heart. Commander of the DAV. Okay, and I'm, I'm here with uh, this is uh, Kevin Harbison. Kevin Harbison. And, and what is this group? This is the Nashua Composite Squadron for the Civil Air Patrol. Oh, I, oh, and what is that all about? Well, the Civil Air Patrol is an auxiliary of the United States Air Force, and we do three missions. One of them is cadet programs, which these, these cadets are part of that in, within the squadron. The other two missions are aerospace education within the squadron and to the community, where we go out and get people excited about aviation. And the other one is emergency services, where we do search and rescue. We historically are known as, as going out and finding lost airplanes. Oh. And we do that. We do a great deal of that. Well, thank you very much for being part of the ceremonies. And uh, is this their first uh, event? No, we do this We do this uh, for the DAV. We carry the colors for the DAV uh, twice a year. We carry it for the Veterans Day ceremony and the Memorial Day parade. We've been doing it for as long as I can remember and beyond that. Wonderful. Well, welcome to the ceremonies. And thank you all for your service. That, okay, thank you. you. Do. Thank all you. Right. Perfect. Thank you. Military Order of the Purple Heart, Commander Al Groh. 
and the Civil Air Patrol with Major Kevin Haberson. Speed. Members of the DAV, Nashua, Gate City Chapter, as well as the Ladies Auxiliary and those who reside at Buckingham Place. Our next division is led by the Elm Street Eagle Middle School Marching Band. Police Athletic League, Pal Force cheerleaders and football players. Yeah. Troop 272, 773. Next division is made up of scouting troops, boys, girls, Cub Scouts from Nashua. It's pack two seventy two. Pack 425. Is this, by the way? 272. Signs up, boys. Signs Just up. Ready? And now. And welcome. We have another uh, a group here. It's Pack uh, 272. And yes, and I'm with. Uh, let me uh, introduce this this distinguished gentleman right here first. Uh, yeah, Lieutenant Colonel John Coughlin. And you're from Nashua. I grew up in Nashua. Live in Amherst now. Yes. Okay. And welcome to the, the ceremonies. Oh, thank you. And thank you. And we have, uh, I heard you t saying you were a Cub Scout at one time? I was in the same group. I grew up in Nashua over on Kinsley Street by St. Joe's Hospital, and that was my group, my troop too. Wonderful. At St. Joe's. At St. Yeah. Joe's. And are you the pack leader? Well, I'm uh, Kevin Reardon. I'm a den leader for the Tigers, and uh, the Tigers are the six-year-olds. Six. And, yep, my first, graders. Here, first graders, and I've done work with the Weaves. Hey, guys, can you, you, let's turn around and take a look at the camera. Wave to the camera. All right, and, and you are? I'm Andy Cupson, Ben, uh, den leader of the Bears. That's the uh, guys with the blue, one, two, my son there, and then one of the last one here. Well, thank you, and I want to thank you for your service. Oh, you're welcome. We really That's want to appreciate it. <laughs> okay. We came over to thank him. That's why hey. we were trying to teach the boys to say thank you to all the soldiers that are here today. So I think it's really important for Cub Scouts to say thank you. So you guys want to do one big thank you on three again? Well, let's let's time. look at the cameras real quick, gentlemen, and let's say thank you to all who are who are serving. One, two, three. Thank you. Pack four twenty-five. Pack two fifty-three. Troop 10203, Girl Scouts. Pack 19, Weeblos.
Daisy Troop 10923. Junior Troop 10947. Troop 10647. Daisy Troop 10495. Okay, well, as you can see now, we're with some brownies, and you are? I am Kate O'Shea. Kate O'Shea, and, and tell us a little bit about uh, our, our group here. This is my lovely brownie troop. We are here today to uh, walk in the Memorial Day Parade. We are made up of second and third graders that attend Bicentennial Elementary School. Well, welcome. Hi, ladies. Hi. So do you know why we're here today? To walk in the parade. To walk in the parade. And who are we honoring? Do you know? People from the Civil War. The wars, the Civil yeah. Wars, so all the wars, right? The people who have fought to defend our country. Can you all say thank you uh, to the cameras and just say thank you for all the people who have served our country? Ready? One, two, three. Thank, thank you. you. Now we have, uh, what pack is this or what group is this? Daisy's 10495. Daisy's, now is this part of the Girl Scouts? Boy Girl Scouts. Scou uh, not Boy Scouts, obviously. <laughs> Girl Scouts. I could tell. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a, a, a small little group here and, and uh, do they become brownies eventually or? Yes, um, they are first year Daisies, all, these three, and then they'll bridge up to brownies um, after next year. Okay, and uh, so are, are you girls happy to be here today? Yeah, all right. Do you know why we're here today? Because we're going to have a parade. <laughs> what are we going to do? We're going to have a parade. And what's your name? Lily Salmon. And what's your name? Lily Hamilton. And what's your name? Well, look at the camera right there and say, what's your name? My name is Heidi. Heidi. And we're going to say thank you to all the people who served our country. And do you want to say that? All right, let's look at the camera and say thank you. Thank what? you. Very good. Troop 10897. The Nashua High School North Titan Marching Band. Nashville Lodge of Elks, 720. The boys and Girls Club of Greater Nashua. I'm with uh, Josh Welber, uh, Director of Teen Services at the Boys and Girls Club of Nashua. How are you? I'm well, and thank you for all being part of the ceremony today. Absolutely. We got 20 motivated and excited kids from the Boys and Girls Club here today. Okay, and tell us a little bit about the Boys and Girls Club. Uh, we're located on 47 Grand Ave. We have youth development programs for, for kids ages 5 to 18. Um, we service uh, thousands of kids in the community. Um, average daily attendance of up over 400 kids a day. Um, we're, we're improving the lives of, of teens uh, and younger members in youth development, um, character and leadership development, sports and recreation, and many other categories as well. How do people get in touch with you? Uh, like I said, we're located on 47 Grand Ave. We have our website at www.bgcn.com. And uh, or give give us a call. All right, wonderful. Hey, can we all just say thank you for all the people who have served in our, our country and have fallen and and have served. 
All together on three, ready? One, One two, two, three. three. Thank, Thank you. you. Members of the National Emblem Club. Marion. And in the white convertible, longtime Elk and the longest serving member of the National Alliance Club, Albert W. Savage. of Nashua's Little League program. And I'm with Howard Eckenrode from the National Little League Board of Directors. And, and tell me, are all these little leaguers? These are all little leaguers. We have T-ball in the middle with the farm guys in the middle and minors and majors on the ends. We're gonna, everyone gets a turn to hold the banner throughout the parade. All right. Hey, can I, do you mind if I ask them to yell out thank you? Yes. Hey, can we all say thank you for everybody who served our country? Thank you! Thank you. Infant Jesus School of Nashua. Nashua Catholic Regional Junior High School cheerleaders. <laughs> Members of Knights of Columbus Council 13904, Grand Knight Marty Walsh. States of America, to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. organization. Next to me, I don't bite. All right. All right. <laughs> How's that? Wonderful. And whenever you're ready, I'm with uh, Linda Howard. I'm the vice president of Nashua Dog Owners Group. We're a nonprofit that was formed to put a dog park in the city of Nashua. And happily, after close to eight years, we're beginning construction. Our fence will be uh, being installed the second week of June. We still have got uh, a lot of fundraising to do to finish it off, but we'll have a place where the dogs can all play safe and secure and uh, be run happily off leash, which we don't have right now. Where is that going to be? Uh, Route 111A, Main Dunstable Road. It's right. one Groton 
uh, Road is the actual physical address right behind yeah. Udiki Field. Oh, yeah. Okay. And now, how, how do people get in touch with you if they want to help you out? Uh, they should uh, go to our website. It's NashuaDog.org. And uh, until we have the play group, we also run a Sunday morning. Uh, excuse me, the dog park. We have a play group on Sunday mornings, from eight to ten. But everybody has to register. So please visit our website. Wonderful, and thank you for being part of the ceremonies. I, I assume okay. that you're going to have some people holding this. Oh, we have some people holding the sign. We got lots of doggies to join in with us, uh, just uh, celebrating all of our veterans. The free and accepted Masons of New Hampshire. Members of the Rainbow Girls and the Eastern Star. And our veterans residing at local health care and retirement centers. <laughs> and our last division approaching is members of the City of Nashua, government vehicles and officials. Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes our Memorial Day Parade. Thank you all for turning out to show your support for those who have served us. Have a great day.